When medical emergencies arise, police are often the first on the scene, and now officers in Hamburg are better equipped than ever to help save lives. Two on your side's Danielle Church shows us the tools that police now have right in their patrol cars. The program is called Tempo, and the police department here in Hamburg received the $75,000 in funding for it back in the early fall. Now all 62 officers in the department are better equipped to handle certain medical emergencies. Town of Hamburg Police Chief Pete Dinez says it's especially important because Hamburg's EMT services come from nine volunteer fire departments. Their backup is AMR, but it can take volunteers a little longer to arrive since they all have other full-time jobs. Well, all police officers do have the, the basic training, however, uh, police officers are usually the first ones on the scene, especially the overnight shift. So with this added uh, tools and equipment and knowledge, they'll be able to start uh, assisting individuals that have a medical condition more quickly. Through Tempo or the Tactical Emergency Medical Patrol Officer Program, the tools can help officers respond to. A severe bleeding can address uh, opioid overdoses and allergic reactions. According to Emergency Services Manager Sean Crotty, Hamburg is the first police department to use Tempo in Western New York. He says the Niagara County Sheriff's Office was the first sheriff's department to get EpiPens, and the Erie County Sheriff's Department has a specialized unit who uses them as well. Tempo also gives school resource officers tools to help respond to medical emergencies in a mass casualty situation. School resource officers in the Frontier School District have two casualty equipment bags to help them. The Hamburg School District has one. The primary goal of the officer in an active shooter situation is to eliminate the threat. And then once that's eliminated, then they kind of go back and assist folks with, with whatever medical care they can give them. Officers will continue to get yearly trainings on tempo. Reporting in the town of Hamburg, Danielle Church, Channel 2 News.